More bike lane fallout tonight, this time from business owners and people who live in University Heights and use Park Boulevard. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Carla Chiquetto. I'm Marcella Lee. CBS 8 has been working for you to cover the mile long project on Park Boulevard. It stretches from Adams Avenue down to University Avenue. CBS 8's Brian White has been in University Heights all day talking to people on both sides of the issue. With the new bike lanes being installed here on Park Boulevard, some business owners around here are not happy about it. We are here to be heard. We are here to say this is not what we want. Several dozen people gathered along Park Boulevard to protest the new bike lanes going in. It's crazy. It's a waste of money. This is ridiculous what is happening. Small business owner Ben Evans says he's losing 16 parking spaces near his shop. Where are our customers going to park? If we lose all of this parking, how are we supposed to stay in business? So Altogether, along this stretch of Park Boulevard, they're losing 88 parking spaces, which is about a third of them. They won't come if they can't park. They're not going to park three blocks away. They're just not. Parking issues aside, they also don't want to lose the center lane. They say it's important for their businesses to function. The reason that that middle lane is so important to us businesses is because we accept deliveries there. So all of our delivery trucks stop in this middle lane right here and uh, offload our goods. So if they condense that into two lanes, uh, I think that is going to cause a lot of traffic jams. But plenty of cyclists are happy about the new lanes going in. They think it'll be a lot safer. I'm really excited about it. This is in my neighborhood. I bike on the street a lot um, and I think it's going to be great for safety. I bike with my kids. You know, this street is fine for me, but the real question is whether this bike lane is safe for, for kids and right now it's not. Will Radigan with the San Diego County Bicycle Coalition agrees. He says it all boils down to safety being top priority. Having safe bikeways is extremely important for San Diego. I think everyone wants to see a neighborhood where they can go out with their family, with their kids, with elderly people go for a bike ride, get to the place they need to go without fearing that their family member is going to be killed. And that's exactly what these bike lanes are doing. I called the city of San Diego's transportation department and they tell me these class four bike lanes will be fully painted by Wednesday. But because of a delayed delivery, the flex posts will be installed a bit later. Meanwhile, some business owners are extremely concerned about what the future holds. We love it here. We love the environment here, but it's going to change dramatically. Businesses like us are going to have a, re have a really hard time staying in business. Working for you in University Heights, I'm Brian White for CBS 8. And don't forget, if there's an issue you'd like us to look into, you can email us at yourstories at cbs8.com.